Often, if I recognize that, either way. Hello? Somebody please help. Hello? I tell you, you try to take a nap in between these weather hits, and you find out, I don't know where I was, in some sort of coffin. I hear lightning, or I see lightning, I hear thunder. You wanted the uh, weather? Well, we got you some weather. <laughs> I heard that weather. <laughs> yes. I okay. wish it was raining outside. Hey, me too. It's hot. Why is it so hot, Matt? Uh, we got a big ridge of high pressure that's pretty much sitting on top of us, and that's what's like up. Like an oven. Yeah, like an oven. Oh, who's this guy? That's Dabney the Clown. Hi, Dabney, Dabney the Clown. No, no, no. My name is Dabney the Clown. I got I'm that. The Minister of Entertainment for Nightfall. Oh, so nah. what do you entertain? How do you entertain people? I have a magic show. You, you gotta do? come see the magic show. I'd love to. You should, you should, most definitely. Can you uh, tell me, psychoanalyze this guy? He's a little weird. <laughs> well, that's just it. He's just weird. He fits that's, it perfect. That's Virgil. I know, that's Virgil. Uh, He's that's my cousin. Virgil, get away yeah. with him. It's all good. Long story. All right, guys. Well, and Nick? Yeah? Awesome stuff, man. Yeah, it's going to be fun tonight. You guys need to come out. Definitely come out. Gates yeah. open at 6 o'clock. Let's talk about your forecast as I walk down this awesome stage of fog. It's fogging outside, guys. We got fog. We got thunder. We got lightning out here, right here at Old Tucson's Nightfall, which, once again, gates open up tonight at 6 o'clock sharp. Come on down. All right, here's what we're tracking. Your Storm Tracker 4 Weather Center. These hot temperatures are going to persist through the weekend. I'll tell you, though, we are inside the theater right now, and boy, does it feel good. It's AC in here. Records likely near, oh, triple-digit heat already. Yes, Saturday and Sunday, about a 40 to 50% chance of 100 degrees, which would represent the latest that's ever happened in the calendar year. So as far as our records go back, and let me tell you, they go back all the way to 1895, but heads up, big pattern change arrives next work week we'll hop outside our storm tracker force sky cam network looking over the tucson mountains we're on the opposite side of the tucson mountains here of course over gates pass it is still 94 degrees same four o'clock temperature as what we were tracking at three i do suspect by five that will come down a little bit winds out of the north at eight miles per hour elsewhere 92 oro valley we got 91 rita ranch lower 90s tucson estates where are the 80s well the 80s are in pinal county we got 82 in oracle still 90 no gallus but Plenty of widespread readings in the 80s across sections of Cochise County. Satellite radar composite does show a couple high clouds working off to our north. They may not seem like much, but they actually cooled us down about three to four degrees today than what we, of course, saw yesterday when we were dangerously close to triple digit heat on our Wednesday. Next weather maker, you got it, that ridge of high pressure that's going to continue to build, especially this weekend. This could be the last weekend, should be the last weekend where we're talking about these excessively hot temperatures this late in the year. And then look at this pattern change as we look at the charts as we make our way into the day Monday. Those white lines are called ice bars. That means the wind's going to start blowing as those lines get closer together as that area of low pressure starts dropping into the Great Basin, picking up our breezes, and dropping those temperatures like a coffin in this theater. As we make our way into next work week, I tell you, it's going to be a long stretch of seeing seasonable, if not at times, below seasonable levels. How about that? Early 60s tomorrow, 7 a.m. Sun comes up at 635. Daytime highs tomorrow, mid to upper 90s. And for the Cats game, oh, just make sure you... Drink plenty of fluids, apply that sunscreen. Yeah, we're looking at 99, nearing 100 degrees at 4 o'clock kickoff. But conversely, look at this trick-or-treat forecast. Only into the 70s next Thursday, one week from today. So here it is, your Storm Tracker 4 10-day tracker. 98 tomorrow, 99 both Saturday and Sunday. Breezes pick up Monday and Tuesday, and that will drop our temps back down below average for this time of year into the mid-70s. Then eventually low 80s. We should settle in by the middle portion of next work week. And with that, those morning lows are going to start coming down into the mid to upper 40s. I think part of the reason why these guys are in such bad moods is because of the heat. It's hot. You guys want a cooler, don't you? Yes, much cooler. It's too hot. Me too. Maybe this will change your attitude if we can cool the temperatures down a little bit, oh, sir. Come on. <laughs> No, okay, that's not how you tag out. Typically, you say reporting live from uh, Old Tucson Nightfall. We'll send it back to you. Yeah, that's a death. Death. Oh boy, those guys are hilarious. Thank you, Matt.